Hi everybody, Clay from Popel's Backyard Farm. You see my beehive over there? Oh, the bees are really swarming good in there and they're, they've taken to it and uh, they're eating the sugar or eating the sugar water I put out for them. And I just got home from work and Ruthie told me to check out the back, back deck. Let me show you what I got. Alright, you know I've been doing the painting of the I bought a second hive and I painted all the parts for it and everything. Well, I had all the parts on the back steps here, including the the frames with the beeswax on them. When I came out here, this whole back deck was nothing but bees. It was they were just swarming all over the place. So I gave them a, I took all the excess frames away. And look what, look what I've got. Bees coming and going. I may have another hive from somebody's lost swarm. I won't know until after we check it out tonight. Once things start calming down a little bit. And then I'm going to move this, close it off and move this hive over to where the other hive is. Maybe about 10 feet away from the other hive. That way. If you can see the bees, see the bees coming and going. If there's a queen in there, you should know shortly because there'll be a bunch of bees at the entrance fanning to let every all the rest of the bees know that the queen is here. If not, it might be just some scout bees looking for a new nest. And if these are the scout bees checking it out, we could have a heck of a lot more bees. We'll have at least two hives. One I bought and one I'm going to get for free. Alright, just wanted to show you what's going on around here. I never expected this. If it... Hopefully we'll have a second hive that stays. I'm going to leave this box here for a day or so. Then I'll close it off. Or maybe I'll move it over there tonight. I know they were attracted to the smell of the wax on the frame, so. Cross your fingers, maybe we'll have two highs instead of one. But if not, one one suffice for now. Okay, this is Clay from Popel's Backyard Farm giving you a little update on what's going on with the bees. Okay, bye-bye.